States. You may recall this was a mass vaccination site when the vaccines first came out. Now it's on the list of potential spots for a mass testing site. Tackling the testing crisis, Boston looking to shorten those long lines with help from a mass testing site. Possibilities include Fenway Park or the Reggie Lewis Center in Roxbury. Many of the sites across the city run by our partners require booking and appointments, and so we know there's a strong, strong demand for walk-in sites. In a couple of weeks, the city says it wants to open at least three walk-in testing sites. It's in talks with the state for a mass site and says all options are on the table. We're going to look at opening a higher capacity capacity testing site that may also include vaccinations. The West End House in Alston just opening yesterday for walk in testing, but it's not all day. Setting up testing at community health centers also options. The mayor says people need a place where they know they won't have to wait. We want both geographic access for our communities, but also for people to know that there's a place that can there's more likelihood that they, they won't have to wait as long in a line. The mayor called the long lines unacceptable. Health officials say they're exploring, directing people to other sites or giving them some shelter while they wait. Putting out a tent or multiple tents so that people are not out there in inclement weather. That's totally inappropriate that people should be out there like that. Now, staffing is a big cause for some of these delays. The city says it is working with community health centers to help alleviate that. We're live here in Roxbury. Sharman Sakedi, WCVB News Center. Sharman, thanks.